Good morning, everybody. Is it recording? Yes, it is recording. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's good morning. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm good. All right. So, I'm not sure if you can hear me, but as you can see, the camera's not on us. It's on <laughs> Why? Dave and Kathy. But um, I wanted to do this interview this morning oh, no. when we had breakfast, but... <laughs> Uh, the McDonald's was packed and there was blasting music, so it really wasn't going to make for great audio or video. So, what I wanted to talk about, last, we left Vegas yesterday, but we didn't do any video because, quite honestly, we just literally had breakfast, packed the car, and left. There was yes. nothing really to record. Yep. But I wanted to ask Dave and Kathy a few questions this morning <laughs> about their trip. So, first question is, what was your favorite thing about Vegas? <laughs> you know, I liked, I love seeing the hotels and the first of the end, the Venetian was my the Venetian, was favorite. Yeah. The Venetian yeah. was your favorite yeah, hotel? Yeah, I think that was my favorite part was seeing the inside and, and seeing the bigness and vastness of it. It's just, and how much money everybody spent on making those places. Yeah. Just yeah. Like, very, yes, very, very cool. Yes, yeah. that, yes, there's a reason that there's no such thing as cheap food on the Strip anymore because they got to pay for those. Yeah. Things. And so the Venetian was your favorite. What was your favorite part? I mean, what caught your eye? What wowed you about the Venetian? Is the, you know, the sky was the, the you know, with the buildings that I mean, look, like I say, I sent that picture to Corey. She thought it was real. We were outside, you know, just yeah. from the picture, and and just then the fact that it went on and on and on. I mean, it wasn't one room. It was room and then two hallways and then another room. And we could have kept hallway. going too. Yeah, <laughs> we, yeah, we did not keep going. Yeah, and it just, you know, it amazes me that somebody could design something and have it flow like it did. Yeah. And, and be that big. And that was amazing. Yeah, I'm trying to re recall the number, but if I recall, the Venetian number was $1.1 billion. Oh, my. When it was done, and it was done, I don't Hadn't know, been, yeah. 10 and or 15 years And that's ago. Yeah, so now it makes triple that now. Yeah. And that's why it's... Uh, so expensive to stay. So we also went to a show. What did we go see? The Cirque Soleil. Oh. Which one? Oh. Oh. The old one. oh. Yeah. That, that was my other favorite part. Yeah. That was just amazing. Yeah, that was. Yeah. The uh, the Cirque du Soleil is um, it's part stage show, part water show. One minute there's a stage, the next minute there's water, and so it's uh, very very cool. Very and cool. how dry they could get the stage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like so, I mean, sometimes dry. you could tell they wanted them to be able to splash a little bit, so yeah. they had that much water on. And other times it was looked like bone dry, completely dry. Yeah, yeah, I was trying to check out how the, they engineered it to get the water off of it, but I never could quite figure it that out. Have a lot of little holes or something. Like, yeah, but there were no puddles. I mean, there was not even what yeah, it was dry. It was dry. Yeah, yeah. Like, uh, when it came up out of the, the bottom of the pool, it came up. And it tilted, so everything just flowed mm. off. That, yeah, that yeah, maybe until just a hair. Just a hair, yeah. Yeah, yeah just a drain. Was, yeah, very interesting. Yeah, yeah. It, was, it was amazing. And how they, you, I still don't know how they would come up from underneath the pool. Yeah, whatever. Because yeah. I mean, you're not all jumping I in. I want to see a behind the scenes how it yeah. worked. <laughs> thing, yeah. <clears throat> I'm guessing around the front part of the stage, the stage solid. At one point, I saw somebody dive in and one of the, the safety divers grabbed them and swim that direction. Yeah. So I'm assuming that underneath the stage There's was some, you could actually maybe swim underneath and go up. Yeah. And so it's airtight it's underneath. Kind of an airlocky thing. Right, yeah. an airlock underneath there somehow. I don't know exactly. I might be completely wrong. But um, you got to assume. Had to something like that. Though. Right, you got to assume that somebody's under there helping people in and out of the water. Yeah, yeah. So, but it would be interesting. I don't know if there's anything on YouTube, but it yeah, might be worth checking that check out. Yeah, check that out, so. yeah. But, um, so is there anything you didn't like about Las Vegas? <laughs> I can't. Probably the one homeless guy that was trying to <laughs> get Jenny to roll her window. Oh, yeah. Down. Yeah. <laughs> that, that was the scariest part. I was like, part. I'm not looking at him. I'm not looking at him. That was the scariest part because I wasn't sure if he was going to try to open the door. I thought he was going to like bang I, on the well, door. He, he did try to grab the door handle. Did he? Yeah. Yeah, I didn't see him. I didn't see him get that close actually. That's yeah, interesting. Well, I didn't see that. But, I'm um, like the doors are locked. The yeah, doors the doors are locked. lock automatically, thankfully. Right. But yes, you know, Vegas does have a dark side. It's got a lot of homelessness. There's a lot of poverty there. We didn't I mean, see but a that, lot of it that though. Was actually, really, you know, I, maybe what the whole. The whole period there, we saw maybe five guys that were... Five to ten, maybe. There was the guy in the fountain. 
Yeah, the guy in the fountain, that was pretty cool. Yeah. yeah he just, and then there was the guy that had, there was a guy or gal that had all the clothes spread out all across the walkway there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't, yeah. don't know. I, I do know what you're talking about, though. But, um, the out of shape showgirls on the street. <laughs> yeah, some of them were not yeah, that, that was a different experience. <laughs> yeah, that's that's very Vegas. I mean, honestly, yeah, it's sure. like. Um, I honestly expected more of that. Actually. Yeah. Actually, there were not as many street performers out. You know, yeah, usually you'll see the Transformers out. Yeah, yeah we didn't see even one Elvis. Yeah. I was so disappointed. Actually, we, you know, we should have gone by the Las Vegas sign, but when we drove by it to go to breakfast, there wasn't an Elvis there. Oh, was there? I missed him. I, there was a fat Elvis there. I missed him. See, <laughs> yeah. that's too yeah, bad. He was, the, he was the fat Elvis, but there was one there. Um, yeah, the old sign. The old sign museum at night was neat. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that was that was very cool. I would actually like to go back there and see if I can't get them to let me bring in a camera. And you know, I took a lot of stuff with my cell phone, but I'd like to get a camera in there. So like just to take stills. Just to take stills. I don't want like to the other part we didn't like was not being able to use coins in the machines. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but that's been gone for a while. Yeah. So. so there's your lesson, Vegas. You need to bring coin slots for back. So. <laughs> My mother-in-law can gamble. What do we? We could probably gamble less than twenty bucks, right? Probably I mean, between the two. I mean, well, between I, I, I think we did about nine or ten, and you put in for five, six, something. Five or six. Right, and then yeah. we went out to the casino. You did ten because you gave me the five. We went out yeah. to Whiskey Pete's. We gambled so, a little bit there, so but about we did uh, twenty bucks total. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, maybe twenty bucks total. Right, exactly. We went out to Whiskey Pete's to see the Bonnie and Clyde car. Obviously, it was not there. It's in <laughs> California somewhere. So, but we saw the impression in the carpet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that was so almost as good. It was, it was almost as good. I wanted yeah. to see the bloody shirt though. I yeah, I can see he, he didn't have snow tires on Bonnie and Clyde. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so uh, probably didn't have snow tires back then. <laughs> probably no such thing. So I guess the big question for me is, would you go back? Sure. You know, I don't know that we'll plan it in the near future or whatever, but I would go back. I mean, it was fun. And there's still, like you say, there's still lots of still things to see. Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, we didn't touch, you know, like the Paris. We, there's there's, there's a, cause a lot of casinos we did not touch. Right. There's a lot mm -hmm. of things. And there's a lot of things to do other than, you know, I mean, there's some, some of the things I want to do is I want to rent a slingshot, which is a little three-wheeled car. I would like to do the zip line down Fremont Street. I mean, we did not go downtown. No. It's kind of, it's, it can be a scary place, but uh, like the guy at the, that was giving us our hot dogs, you know, it's a weekday, so it's probably not as bad. Yeah, yeah. yeah. pick your times, so, yeah. So <laughs> would you go back alone? Would you go back just the two of you? <laughs> it's more fun with more, more people. More people, but you know, I wouldn't be totally opposed to it, but, but yeah, it would be more fun to go with somebody again. Yeah. 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 Right. So, positive. <laughs> so overall, a very positive, good experience. Oh yeah, it, was oh, yeah. One of our, it's, it's, it really was one of our more fun trips. It was a lot trips. more family oriented than I ever imagined. Yeah, it was like Disney. <coughs> like yeah, yeah. could never understand why Tim would take the kids, but there was a lot to do for kids. Really. Yeah. yeah. And, and New York, New York, the the street that you sit on to eat outside mm -hmm. looked looked just like a New York street. Yeah, just. Yeah, people watching is fun. And, and, and then that's <laughs> part of the hotel. Are you kidding me? Yeah. They were like, what? What do you think, Jenny? About one third scale or two thirds scale? Something of the apartment building. Yeah. yeah. The apartment building. Yeah. But it went on for a whole block and a half. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And it really did look like the buildings you'd see in movies and stuff right next to each other. Yeah. We got to see a lady get drunk and dance. <laughs> Yes, fun. we got to see a lady get drunk and dance. We, we saw that a lot when we were we go to the Mandalay Bay right. at the lounge and when they're dancing out there. Yeah, that was. It's always yeah fun to people watch. <laughs> yeah, and it's it. I think we had a good experience, and I think a lot of people post COVID when they opened out back up have not. I think they're yeah. Some people have said crime has gone up, um, and uh, I think yeah. a guy drowned in the uh, Bellagio fountain. Mm -hmm. uh, some tourists apparently bribed him to go in and he actually drowned so uh but uh we had i would say an overall very good experience oh yeah, oh, yeah. it was great <laughs> better than i expected good oh good oh good that's that's actually good to hear <laughs> yeah well, you should you know, never know quite what to expect or whatever so yeah like, should we be there <laughs> yeah <laughs> no and and that's you know that's in vegas you do you know you kind of wonder sometimes because you know the the security at the hotels is also you know always very good but yeah 
get past that and it's like you don't know what you're gonna run into. Yeah, so. yeah. which is the one nice thing about it, since you guys kinda know where to go and where not to go. It's good yeah. to where not to know where not to go too. Yeah. Yeah, as you go further north on the strip that's that's where it gets more sketchy. Yep. Yeah, absolutely. I mean yeah, it's just like any other big city that it's there's problems with drugs and homelessness. Yeah, so. yeah. <clears throat> but we didn't see too much of that thing. No. All right. Is that about it? Did I miss anything, Jennifer? I don't think so. All right. <laughs> Very good. I'm gonna shut off the camera. All right. All right. Hold on. So for now, I'm Chris. I'm Jen. And those that's Dave and Kathy in the back, the <laughs> Vegas newbies, and we will <laughs> see you on a couple of weeks when we go to Estes Park for the Elk Run. We're going up to Estes Park in a couple of weeks to see the elk. Um, elk and Aspen. The Aspen. I was going to say Aspen would be oh, changing yeah. too. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Let's call it the Elk and Aspen trip. Elk and Aspen. Elk yeah. and Aspen. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.